All right. Summertime is here again, which means time for some backyard grilling. How would you like a red wine that's versatile enough to pair with many different types of grilled fare? Let's talk about that and more on today's Quick Sips. So as the warmer weather begins to roll in, you're gonna see a lot of different kinds of foods coming off the grill. Anything from asparagus to pork chops and spare ribs. So is there a wine out there that's versatile enough to have with all these different types of grilled foods? In my opinion, the answer is yes. And this is it right here. This is Cabernet Franc, originally from France, but now found all over the world. And it's one of my favorite grapes. Now, as you may have guessed, Cabernet Franc is related to Cabernet Sauvignon. It may not be as famous, but it's every bit as delicious. If I had to describe Cabernet Franc to you, I'd say it's softer and more supple than Cabernet Sauvignon. It has these beautiful flavors of cassis and plums, sometimes black cherries. These types of flavors are well suited to grilled meats, especially white meats like pork and chicken. And sometimes when it's not grown to full ripeness, Cabernet Franc gets a little bit of this green tomato leaf flavor to it, which as you might guess, could pair very well with vegetables. Even though Cabernet Franc is a slightly more full-bodied red wine, it's still light enough to pair with all that great summer food. In fact, I like to throw mine in the refrigerator and chill it up just a bit. There are two major regions in France where this grape is the star, but now it's grown all over the world. It's doing particularly well on the eastern coast of the United States in places like New York, Pennsylvania, and Virginia too. This bottle right here is from Argentina. Now, because the original French Cabernet Franc has been around for so long, you'll find those prices tend to be a little bit higher. If you want something affordable for everyday drinking, look to the other parts of the world for a Cabernet Franc that'll run you anywhere from $12 to $20 a bottle. That's nice. Okay, so now that you know a little bit about Cab Franc, go out and get yourself a bottle and pair it up with your grilled fare and let me know how it went. Don't worry, I'm not gonna grill you too hard. Hey, do you think you'd like tips like these delivered to you personally every week? If so, subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking that little button down there, and I'll send you a new video every Tuesday. Here's to your health, my friends. A Voltresante.